Hello and welcome back to a very frustrated vampire, uh, Jonathan Reed, who is uh, struggling. Are we gonna kill innocents to get stronger? Or are we just gonna... Struggle. Struggle very much. To do the right thing, as much as possible. I'm proud to say that I've not taken a life. Uh, just a snack on them. If I decided to kill those who uh, didn't attack me, I killed them because they were jerks. Come on. No. Attack him. We need the snack. What? How tanky are you? So I have like, I don't know, 800 HP. And they have like 4,000. Okay. So where do we find the insulin? I just uh, kick out the looters and uh, use this place. Am I supposed to go downstairs? I wouldn't necessarily want to go into the basement again, unless we have reason to. Shot at. What the f Great game, you did it! I didn't even see that guy. That's why I think is uh feeding is very interestingly solved in this game. Because feeding in combat is a suicide, basically. But the the developers want to make it an option. And the only way they could make it an option is by making you invincible. And, uh... Well, you, you cannot be interacted with in any way while you're feeding. But once you're down feeding, of course you can be interacted with. Alright, rest in peace, mate. And go outside. Okay, we're gonna start with this guy. One of them here. What? No, 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 no. What the fuck is that? I just, I just, you just can't. Like, I'm so far behind that even if I killed like 20 civilians, there's just nothing I can do. If you're not strong enough, uh, remember that the blood of citizens is the fastest way to evolve. Yeah, but the dynamic difficulty is just stupid. I'm killing one guy. There's like literally one guy here. One bloody guy. Yeah. 
He gets hit by my club of death. So many times. And he's just fine. One on one, it's somewhat doable. What the fuck was that? Well, we're immune to it while we're feeding. Oh my god! Remember your vows, friends! I'm over here. What was that? Fear no evil. We do the Lord's work here. I just gotta leave the tanky boy for last. Demon, back! It's done for you. <sighs> what about you? No, get interrupted. So, where are you guys hiding the insulin? What? Can't go there. 70 meters, apparently. In the morgue. Ah, oh, I should have known. Wait, what? Apparently I am supposed to go up? No, uh, okay. Seems like I had the right idea. In the morgue. On this level, over here. Oh, that's it. There it is. Insulin. Much more efficient than garlic against blood poisoning and sepsis, and much less dangerous for me. Thank you, Dr. Polescu. Find the hideout to create the antidote. Oh, we don't need to look very far. That's partially why I wanted to end my trip near the Pembroke because we have a hideout here I assume that we gotta do some crafting so I'm gonna mix the blood of the most powerful vampire with some powerful saint or powerful man I don't know it seems like a, a sketchy uh, a recipe but hey, what do I know? Just mix blood with blood and uh, some insulin for good measure. What could go wrong? Ooh, look at that. We found the last one. The blend seems stable. Time to go and find Harriet in the sewers. I have some XP. I can maybe get some more health. Cost 600. Confirm. But that's not 200 health, that's plus 50, so... It's not as good. I suppose every little bit helps. Yeah, 920 life now. Can I just jump down? Reach the hive. Wait, what? So far away! Four hundred meters. By the time I get there, I have to fight 
so many tugs. What's even the efficient way to get, get there? I have no idea. See how he dress? Looks like an aristocrat. We have a killer. A killer? I suppose that's correct. The Lord commands you. It's an H. Kill it. I managed to aggro more guys. Have faith, by sound of it. Wait, what? Did I manage to aggro even more guys? Oh, game. Why are you forcing me to do this? It's just no fun. Crush the leech, boys! Stay back, beast! Steady, boys! We've got one out! Hey, guys. What's up? Open the gate. Keep up the good work, lads. Hey, stinky zombie. Whoa, what? No! Nullified. Okay, leave her up. I don't want to fight you, stinky zombie. Resisting my abilities. So high level. I'm just gonna die. Resist it. It doesn't even work. There's, there's no winning against these guys. You, you get nothing out of it. You just lose. Let me through. At least this works. Didn't resist it. I need to go for a snack. And that's it. Oh, yeah, we can open it now. Of course, we were in a fight. What? Where did I end up? Uh, yeah, that's good. That's good. We're going the right way. Kinda. Oh, a guy? Are good you evening, drink? sir. Good evening. Why must it always be a good evening? I was just being polite. I'm Dr. Reed. I'd like to ask you some questions, if I may. Don't like questions. Or doctors. And the name is Seymour Fishburne, if you must know. Don't really care. You have a cold. Oh. Goodbye, Mr. Fit. Oh, we can't give him the... Good evening, Mr. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for the... How do I give him the thingy? Do you require medical assistance? <laughs> That's something I didn't expect to hear again. A doctor concerned with the elf. To zip it. You want this or not? I don't know which kind of doctor you're used to dealing with, but it's a doctor's purpose to heal people. And is it your purpose as well, Mr. Reed? I would say it's a convenient way for gaining people's trust. Oh, look at that. He is good. Are you a jerk? Can we mesmer well, we Goodbye, can mesmerize him. But I don't wanna. Don't care too much about healing people. I was just checking on him, whether he's a jerk. Then we can justify killing him. Because these are hard times. Oh, 
Oh yeah, rats. Come over here. I have this thirst for blood. You always say the same thing. Hey guys, what's up? I'm staying back. I have max health and max blood. I have nothing to gain by fighting people. What? <clears throat> sure. So, which way am I supposed to go now? Maybe I drop down? Seems pretty uh, extreme for your peaceful vampire shelter, uh, Sean. Uh. Oh, what the hell, Sean? This is a bit much. But I'm just looking for the hideout. Apparently this, the hideout has a secret entrance here, but I'm not sure where. where. Where is it? Is it here? That's clearly not on the second floor. It's gotta be somewhere else. I'll just go away. Oh. So, can we find... It's locked, all right. A door that leads to that special hideout. Um... I can't see a damn thing. Reach the hive. Apparently we are on this... On the level we need to be, but we are 76 meters away from the point we should be. So maybe not here. No, it's here. It it's here, right? How do I find it though? Oh, this is where we had a talk with Sean. Is it? Yeah. Sean. Sean, what happened to you? Come on! This is an easy fight. You cannot take so much damage. Attack once more. What the fuck? I just want to knock him once more. I really don't like the lock camera. But also the other camera options are... Yeah, well... This is a bit, bit odd as well. So, yeah, this has got to be the place. I am coming! Are we just gonna find out that the skulls are nothing but, uh, mindless, uh, well, zombies in a way? No, they are not. Old Bridget, well, she's old, so, no, the skulls can definitely be more than that. Enter at your own risk. This place has been ransacked. Was it? 
They've all been slaughtered. Pre one. No, not their style. Not their style? Well, Ascalon Club were Preven. Uh, take your pick. The Ascalon Club definitely knew their location. Locate Harriet Jones. But why would the Lord Redgrave give me? Well, he only gave me a drop of the blood. Maybe it's maybe it's fake. But why would be well quote unquote help me? This is what he's planning. Well, this place is wiped out, good and proper. So where is Harriet Jones? Wait, what? Wow. I don't think we had knowledge of this place previously. Where is old Bridget? Damn. If I'd come earlier, they would still be alive. Okay, some blood marks on the floor. No, a demon overlord. I'm not talking to you. Fuck off. Really? I'm gonna stand behind your back. Can I just show up some demon as a demon guy as well? Alright, let's have a talk. Take not a step further, child, for you are unprepared. You, at last. I wondered when you would show your face again. Step away. We have nothing to discuss. Desist, child. You cannot confront the monstrosity unleashed upon this land without due preparation. I shall not allow it. All right. <laughs> but no more riddles. Enough of the obscure songs and prophecies. I ask questions, and you answer them. My words have been as clear as crystal lakes, my child. You seem unwilling to drink, to listen, to learn. Why did you choose me? Why did you choose me? Only you could provide a modern, scientific answer to this ancient, mystical thread. Modern answer, ancient threat? Speak to me of this ancient threat. The blood of hate. Vessel of the wrath of the goddess. When she awakens, a disaster will be born into this world. For she is hunger and anger. What kind of modern answer? Disease, contagion and contamination. How they course through veins is your dominion, my child. Your choices have made you. Only you can save this land. Sure. Your true appearance? What is your true appearance? I do not understand. This is who I am. You're made of blood and you're like a quad devil? Blood? You are made of blood? Surely you are joking. Why would I? And no, I'm not made of blood. I am blood. Blood is what I am since my birth and for eternity. But who are you really? But who are you really? Tell me your name. I am your maker. I am the servant of the Red Goddess and protector of this land. I have many names. Oh. Just give me one then. There are those who call me Murdin Wild, the Wild Horned Man. But I never was a man. I was born out of blood. I'm here to stop Harriet Jones. Uh, yeah, that's kind of the plan. I'm here to stop Harriet Jones. She is the original carrier. The well from which this corruption flows. 
I have heard you, but be wary. Harriet Jones's mind is no more. She has metamorphosed into an apocalypse. Born from, drenched in, and driven by the blood of hate. What is the blood of hate? What is the blood of hate? It is the curse of the goddess. It is the hunger in you. The need for blood. The will to strike and to punish. To spit in the eye of God. Tell me about this disaster creature. I know London fell victim to such a thing in 1666. A disaster is pure anger born through blood. Its name means bad star, for they only appear when our queen unleashes her unquenchable wrath upon the world. Who is the queen? And who is this queen? She is the Red Goddess, the Queen of Blood. In my youth, a hundred lifetimes ago, she was worshipped as the Morrigan. She is my mother. She is yours, too. The Morrigan? The Celtic Goddess of War? Is this a ruse of some kind? She has been worshipped in many forms throughout the ages. The true nature of the Red Queen is beyond your comprehension, eluding even mine. But know this, she is a vengeful mother. Okay, so we gotta watch out for Morrigan. Disaster is just an accident? So the disaster is some sort of accident. A disease. Vampires carry dormant in their blood, waiting to emerge. That's your modern answer. But a disaster is at the same time both less and more. Tell me what it is then, in your own words. A disaster is the pure will of our queen. Whenever she dreams of walking this earth, she awakes in this putrid vessel. I don't want to stop the epidemic. I don't care about this bloodsucker business. I only wish to know how to put an end to this epidemic. To perform an act so noble, you must protect yourself from its poisonous kiss, my child. That would be nice. I know. McCullum used such a serum when trying to kill me. However, I have produced a more efficacious version of the antidote. Your final task awaits you at the end of these tunnels. I've known for ages you were worthy of this challenge. My champion, Bittersweet. Ages? What will happen then? What will happen thereafter? What future awaits me beyond these dark tunnels? Your fate, my child, and the fate of this land. A disaster is about to enter this world to smite us all and teach us humility. You are our final hope. Why not you? Will it be over then? Will it be over then? Once I've defeated this creature? Yes. The threat will dissipate like so much smoke. For you will have purified its source. And then what? What will become of me? How would I know? I am no god, and your fate is in your own hands. For you are our champion. Right. I'm not your champion. I can't help but feel that the game would be better without this uh, exposition before our fight. Maybe the end. I don't know. You tricked me. My sister died for your schemes. I have brought suffering and tragedy into this world. I am not, nor will I ever be your champion. Very soon you'll come to know that sacrifice is sometimes necessary. I understand the grudge a child bears towards his father and mother. Be brave, my child. 
That's it. Time to get my ass handed to me by Harriet. Do I need to drink that special liquid? Or will I automatically use it? I don't have it. So I, I guess I just have it or whatever. Probably. That's not why I have it in the first place. These poor skulls didn't stand a chance. Where am I going? Okay. Oh, that way. Hello there. Oh, boss fight area. Not more of this. I'll be glad to be of assistance. Ah, oh, like your help, Doris. Liars! All of you! <coughs> oh. She's puking the sewer, possibly baby. water supply. I've been such a bad mother. But the Queen herself forgave me. Gave me another chance. Harriet. You must stop all of this. I can't let you infect anyone else. How dare you interfere with the Red Queen's plans, Doctor? How can you stop the course of nature? No. Oh, yeah. We are ready to fight. You took my daughter from me. What the fuck? I can't heal fast enough. Great. So everything is insta kill in this fight. Alright, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, 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 cool. I get. Well, I lost all my blood now because that's, that's apparently totally acceptable. No! Apparently she's just dealing damage to me even if she's not hitting me. Um, okay. Can you just not go into the bloody smoke? No, it's it's impossible. Jonathan Reed is fucking stupid. He can't swing his freaking club without stepping into that bloody uh green smoke. Let's puke, whatever. Why, Reed? Nobody ever helped me. I've been alone all my life. Oh! Oh! Need to go back. Ah! What? Okay, explain. How did I got hit? Makes zero sense. Why am I losing health now? Hard. What? Explain. Explain. Perfect. Perfect. 
You done it, game. Pisses me off. So we probably shouldn't use our ultimate right away. No, I we can't go there. We got hit. Okay. Okay, she went out of it. What? What is this? Look at that. This is the I step back plus you instantly die. Look at this. How much damage we're gonna take. It's still going down. We almost died. There's a good chance Reed is gonna go into the green smoke. Need to go for a snack. Harry is somewhat wounded. Okay. I might just uh, suspend her again, just so we can go there. Somewhat safely. Oh, okay. She's cheating again. No! Be die! Be die! Done! I mean, what, what are you supposed to do with that? Like, if there's like a... A cast time or activation time of that ability, it's like 0 0.4 seconds. Or I don't know the conditions that m makes her activate it. It's like I have to watch out for her blinking with his uh, left eye. Good luck with that. Look at that. Look at that. We got hit. We're dead. There's nothing I can do now. Oh, we didn't die. Well, basically, that's uh, that was uh, unwinnable. Where is she now? One thing we can do is use our syringes, but we need to use them after we actually know how to fight this boss, because that's how it works. You just gotta go in, get savagely destroyed. Because if you use your syringes, not like you have a quick save or anything. No, you actually lose your syringes. And if you they lose the fight again, you start with like zero uh, blood. I don't know. Okay, Harriet. What the fuck? We dead. We dead. Okay. So how does that trigger? Should we not hit her in the front? So if you hit her in the front, you instantly lie and uh, lose the fight. Sure. If I could make uh, Johnny, Jonathan Reed, uh, like a proper range character, I would. But apparently, you can only have limited amount of ammunition. And I don't want to deal with the hassle. Okay. Sure. No cheating. No! I'm, I, how am I supposed to do it? My poor baby! Where is she? I don't know what to do, guys. There is no difficulty setting. Everything is insta kill. Nobody and the abilities trigger instantly as well. I've been alone all my life. I can't go there. One thing I could possibly do is just wait for her to do stuff. What the fuck? Okay. What we're gonna do is just watch what 
she's doing she and try to learn. Okay. At least that has an activation time. I want you to do the the puke slash back out skill. Are you gonna do that? Because that's the cheatiest of them all. I'm there though. That skill is just stupid. If she keeps doing that, we just lose. Like, literally my best option is just to wait for my ultimate. Not doing nothing. And just dodging. Because we need to disable her. I'm not so sold on the blood shield either because a lot of abilities go through it. Yes! Go away! She's gonna explode! Or transform? Of course explode. Is this a dream, my child? What? Am I awake? Is this anger I feel? Is it wrath? I think it is. Oh, how infinitely, how intensely, how irredeemably are you all going to suffer now? Hey, mother. Can I just snack on this uh, blood? So what we need to do is not fight. Just see her abilities. So she can do the same thing as the other vampire. For this is my body. Oh, for fuck's sake. That's bad. That's bad. Okay, they're dead. So we're going back to destructions. There's no way to... Such innocence! Uh, steal life from her. I might just have to do a blood infusion. Queen's Avatar. I'm going away. Give me more. They are so young, so tasty. 
Oh, no, 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 no. We're just gonna... What the hell? Screw... Screw you guys. Go back to explosions. I'm fine with that. Uh-oh. Looks like she's doing something special. I will replay for this is a mind of the harvest. Red the crop. Now more guys. Or guys all the time. Is she gonna leave this stage? Oh, I can! Alright, time out! Give me more! They are so young! So tasty! No! Gotta go away! Looks like this might be the strategy. You just played super safe. Why not? Oh boy, this is bad. This is bad. Okay. I really hope this is not gonna turn into another boss fight. No one could ever defeat you, mother of us all. For you are our every root and leaf. You've always been my most amusing son. Then go back to sleep. My queen, and smile at us from your dreams. Did they feel my wrath? Have they suffered enough? More than ever, mother of us all. Until the next time. Until the next time. What? Uh huh. Great. So it's over then. Young Ekon. You have put an end to this terrible menace. You're watching? Old Bridget. What are you doing here? This is my realm, Ekon. This is Suaskal territory. Is it though? But they were all massacred by the monstrosity that Harriet became. Others will come, engendered by deceitful vampires. I don't mean you, of course. I thought you'd been slaughtered, with all the other sewer scars. I was up above, in search of help when Harriet suddenly turned into that thing. I have no idea what it was. It's over now. London is no longer shrouded in the disaster's shadow. We're all safe. Yes. You prevailed in the end. I hope you'll forgive me for the way I treated you when first you presented yourself at our gate. No need to apologize, really. Perhaps there will be no stories told or songs sung of what happened here today. But I'll know the truth. Jonathan Reed, newborn vampire, stepped forward and saved us all. I'm honored to be part of this city's legend. Thank you, old Bridget. May I ask you just one question? How could I refuse you anything now? I'll answer just as I answered Lady Ashbury when we met a few nights ago. Who are you? Really? I was born with the name Bridget Eleanor Wellington. In 1738, my beloved and immortal husband decided to preserve my beauty and youth forever by making me drink his blood. You were Lord Redgrave's wife. Then the pompous fool rejected you, did he not? It was about 200 years ago. Peace found me in time. And I sincerely hope it will find you too, now that all is over. No, it's not over. 
I may have ended the vampire epidemic, but I still need answers from the woman I love. I what feared you hell? would say that. Go then, young Ekon, and face your fate. Just remember that I'll always be here for you. Okay. Raise an eyebrow. London has been cleansed. This catastrophe came about when an ancient malignant will crossed paths with mortal imprudence. For now, we are safe. For now, my craving for blood remains. Red like hate, red like hunger, red as life and death, passing from one immortal to another, from predator to victim, patiently biding its time to rise again. London has been cleansed for now, but there's a simmering hatred, fear, and old grudges. When will we succumb, mortals and immortals alike? The next disaster is only a matter of time. My only hope now is to catch the woman I love, to understand why she fled, and unmask the secret that has been lurking in her blood for so long. The end of the next chapter. <laughs> oh, the red car she had. We took it. Well, this is it. Lady Ashbury's Domain. Why am I not surprised it's not on any maps? I'd better hurry. Her for what? Find by Elizabeth's blood. Create diseases. Okay, I like it. But, uh... Let's... Find it out next time. I don't know how, how much is left from the game. Maybe it's a whole new uh, long chapter, but it's appropriate to take a break now. With my sweet car. Wow, this could be uh, the perfect profile picture. Look at this. Oh, how, do we, how, how should we do it? Oh yeah, that's it. Click! Go for it. It would be nice if uh, we turned the car around. A little bit nicer. But even like this, it's just like, hey, I just casually park my car in front of my castle. Nice. Anyway, uh, this is for now, guys. Uh, see you next time.